Well, Henry, when you joined us, I'm sure this was the dream. Today's the dream to realise. Yeah, this has been uh, it's been a work in progress, um, but every year we've just taken another step and uh, close last year and uh, this year we did it. You talked when you did the press and the build-up about how, how calm, how relaxed the group was and that just really showed it out on the pitch there, didn't it? Yeah, I think straight, straight from the beginning we just took the ball, played our game, uh, scored two quick goals. Um, yeah, so uh, a well-deserved well win. And then after, after that, we got signed at held Swansea at arm's length for, for most of the rest of the game then? Yeah, I think we defended well. Uh, obviously, it's a big game, so you don't want to risk too much. Uh, so maybe we kicked a little bit too much, but that's the way it is when, you, when you're up 2-0. It's, uh, it's fine by me, because we were just defending like beast, beast down there. When the final whistle went, do you, do you know what you, was going through your mind then? Uh, I was just thinking about my family. Um, they haven't been here this, this, this year, so it's been, uh, it's been really, really hard. Um, so I was just been working so hard for them and for me uh, for the team uh, so yeah I was thinking about them so uh, it's just just a huge thing and some quite good celebrations afterwards as well weren't there yeah it was all right it was all right no it was, it's this is just amazing uh, even with the fans it's so much better than last year I know we lost but but still to play in Wembley with without fans is not it's, it's not a real thing uh, so it was it was brilliant today I say that the fans delivered last week against for the Bournemouth game and delivered again today in the stands. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, even though there weren't enough fans, uh, it was still still amazing and uh, what a stadium and, and it doesn't take a lot of people to, to, to create a good atmosphere. Yeah. And there's so many there's so many stories, so many so many great stories coming coming through this dressing room. It must be so great for you to share it with you know the Peter, the, the coaching staff, the young boys who've come in and you know, first taste of football, the, the B team lads who are stepping up. Yeah, uh, again, we've we've all been part of this. Uh, even even we have had some injuries and and people just stepping in. Uh, like you said, B team players can up training with us, getting the debut, uh, just doing their job, uh, and that just says a lot about this team. And again, the coaching staff they keep they keep pushing. They want to get even more professional. Um, yeah, we've been working so hard, so it's uh, it's so well deserved. And when you when you picked up your, your injury last month, there was never any chance you were going to miss the playoffs, was there? <laughs> <laughs> if you if you ask the physios, uh, I'm, I'm I'm not sure they they thought it would be possible. But uh, I was I was out for four weeks, and I should have been out for eight. So um, I'm I'm grateful for this body. It's it's not that old. <laughs>